Hey guys, in the this site from 24 by 7 everything, finally we got an update from Asus itself. Uh, it's related to Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 and with the security patch of June 5, 2019 and even digital well been have been added and also uh, the dark theme has also been optimized correctly. But before that, let me show you the updated version of our Pi version uh, with the security update and so on. So for that, I'll be going to about phone and let me click on here let me zoom it and so that you can view it so now you can view that android security patch level it's showing june 5 2019 and below that it's build number again it's 1906.055 then preceded by the actual date so basically it means that they have finalized this particular build in the month of july itself on 3rd of uh, july so this is all about the latest version now let's move uh, to see what what else have been added so as I've, I've, uh, I've already told you that its security patch has been updated and we have also confirmed it. Let's move to the dark theme related thing. So now I'll click our long pass. Earlier this power off button was disabled but now as they have optimized the dark theme so it's been functioning properly. Let me move to the uh, actual dark theme again to show you the main part. So for that uh, we will be going to device theme so it has three options one is automatic then light and dark if i'll click on light it will change to the light version so this is what light which is plain white now if i'll click on again long press it's a light version now let me again check change it to dark and now it has been changed and now that particular bug has been also resolved now apart from this the bigger thing from the, i think all of the community members are asking or i i would say all the asus users are asking that why we are not getting digital well-been when we are having a stock version of android and so on so finally we are able to view digital well-been so this is the digital well-been and it is showing me that what i have done and so on that 22 minutes today uh, work, uh, i have used this particular device and on that i have opened word chrome i have opened settings microsoft launcher is my uh, default launcher on this machine and so on and by this way it has again various things like uh, at this moment i have uh, as what we, uh, i have activated the do not disturb thing so that's why you are able to view uh, that particular round circle with hyphen uh, let me zoom it uh, along uh, just before the wi-fi sign so this was all about the update now let me tell you that how you can update it for that you just have to visit this particular link and let me tell you this is not been using any third party tool like TWR, RP or uh, it's uh, the Russian version it's again the Indian version or I would say a global version so you can even view the actual path uh, sorry actual URL it's showing us uh, let me that it's uh, their server.asus.com then the public directory then asus uh, and so on and at last you can able to view www. Uh, sorry ww-16.20 and 17.1906.055 which is actual version so i will post this particular link in description and i will also try to add this into a, a card link so that uh, when uh, you can even uh, go into this particular url and download you just have to go into this particular url uh, from your device let me show you how So afterward, you just move to your browser, whatever you uh, use. So just search here, paste it here, and as soon as you will click it here, your downloading will start. So this, let me zoom it. So now it's showing. Uh, so actual file size of this particular file is 1.53 GB. So let me show you the actual details. So now it has started. As I have already did this part, so from my side it is not needed. But let me show you uh, after downloading what you have to do so you can use any of your file manager so i am using this part so for that you, first you will traverse or you, first you will go to download folder uh, you will find that particular file just move that particular file to the internal storage so your internal storage uh, let me show you Intern at this moment i have kept that particular file here and after here and afterward you have you just have to restart your device and as soon as you will restart your device it will prompt you that a new update has been detected and it will start installing it after having some few clicks like do you want to install it now and so on so this was all about the latest update which we were waiting from very long time 
and apart from this there were a few other bugs as well like uh, sound related thing and so on for that we will be needing few, uh, like at least two to three days of time to analyze each and every bit like whether uh, the sound is being coming uh, correctly or not apart from this is there any other major bug or not but at this moment after using it for last six to seven hours uh, i can say that this is working absolutely fine yes one one last thing and one most thing is that after installing it please wipe your uh, device uh, i would say not device please wipe your cache partition for that we have already created a uh, video and for that we will again be uh, adding that in description uh, and as well as uh, we'll be adding it to the card link so this was all from our side this side in the for 24 by 7 everything Hope you like this video. If you like this video, kindly share it with your friends and family. And apart from this, it will be really appreciated if you can subscribe to our channel uh, so that in future we can bring these kinds of such videos uh, that will surely help the community and the end users. Bye for now. Have a great day.